What's up you guys, Idiot Fliptronics. So I'm going to be helping you guys out if you're trying to get rid of a virus on your Galaxy S7 or Galaxy S7 Edge. So you guys, typically, um, if you have a virus, there's a few things that are going to be happening. You might be getting some pop-up ads on your home screen, which can happen just out of nowhere. You might be getting it in the browser as well. That's another thing that can start happening. So if you're starting to get ad pop-ups or even video ads for no reason, there's a good chance you have a virus. Another thing this is going to do, you guys, is make your phone extremely hot. Um, you'll also experience some lag, so it's definitely a good idea to get this taken care of. Um, and the overheating issue will, you know, eventually ruin your battery, and then, you know, your battery life will become, you know, drained really quickly. So what I recommend doing, you guys, is, um, you know, first doing a hard reset on your phone. You're going to want to, you know, do this. Just make sure to back everything up first. Um, you know, as soon as you do that, you guys, uh, my next uh, tip would be to get some kind of security app on your on your phone and the one I'm recommending to you guys is called uh, AVG antivirus there's um you know a free edition in here and then uh you know a paid um option if you guys like the free version which is really cool it pretty much monitors your monitors your phone 24 hours a day um, you know, if there's any suspicious activity or any downloads or anything like that. Um, you also can, you know, randomly pick up a virus from a an app from the Play Store. It doesn't have to be like a third-party app. It could be an app from the Play Store since, you know, there's so many in there and some of them go, you know, through, uh, you know, whatever the security is, um, you know, getting an app in there. But anyways, you guys, you definitely want to get this taken care of right away because you don't want to compromise any information on your phone. Um, and then you definitely want to put a security app. So you just do a hard reset or a factory reset on your phone. Just back up all your stuff on your PC first or Dropbox or Google Drive and then get a security app on your phone so you can prevent this from happening again. I'd appreciate it if you guys liked this video, shared it. As always, stay tuned for more and be sure to subscribe to our channel.